Good day and peace be with you. Today is Wednesday, the 1st of February 2023. Hallelujah. We are into a new month, the second month of 2023. Lord, we thank you for who you are. We praise your wonderful works. For you are the creator of all, yet so intimately near. Forgive us for the times we have made you an afterthought. Teach us to come to you with the humility and joy of a child. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our reading for reflection today continues from the book of Judges, chapter 10, verses 1 to 18. And the theme for reflection is, The Israelites said to the Lord, We have sinned. Let us listen, beloved, to the word of the Lord. After the time of Abimelech, a man called Issachar, named Tola, son of Pua, the son of Dodo, rose to save Israel. He lived in Shemir, in the hill country of Ephraim. He led Israel 23 years, then he died and was buried in Shamir. He was followed by Jer of Gilead, who led Israel 22 years. He had 30 sons who rode 30 donkeys. They controlled 30 towns in Gilead, which to this day are called Havoth, Jaya. When Jaya died, he was buried in Kamon. Again, the Israelites did evil in the eyes of the Lord. They served the Baals and the Ashtoreths and the gods of Aram and the gods of Sidon the gods of Moab, the gods of the Ammonites, and the gods of the Philistines. And because the Israelites forsook the Lord and no longer served him, he became angry with them. He sold them into the hands of the Philistines and the Ammonites, who that year shattered and crushed them. For 18 years they oppressed all the Israelites on the east side of the Jordan in Gilead and the land of the Amorites. The Ammonites also crossed the Jordan to fight against Judah, Benjamin, Ephraim. Israel was in great distress. Then the Israelites cried out to the Lord, We have sinned against you, forsaking our God and serving the Baals. The Lord replied, When the Egyptians, the Amorites, the Ammonites, the Philistines, the Sidonians, Sidion the Amalekites, and the Maorites oppressed you, and you cried to me for help. Did I not save you from their hands? But you have forsaken me and served other gods, so I will no longer save you. Go and cry out to the gods you have chosen. Let them save you when you are in trouble. But the Israelites said to the Lord, We have sinned. Do with us whatever you think best, but please rescue us now. Then they got rid of the foreign gods among them and served the Lord, and he could bear Israel's misery no longer. When the Ammonites were called to arms and camped in Gilead, the Israelites assembled and camped at Mizpah. The leaders of the people of Gilead said to each other, Whoever will take the lead in attacking the Ammonites will be head over all who live in Gilead. Here ends our reading for today. Thanks be to God. And remember to share the good news with others to encourage them to draw closer to Christ. Have a blessed day. Amen.